Day 34 of trying to explain every single node in Blender. And today we have the light path node. The light path node is one of the input nodes, which means that it only has outputs. And this one has a whole lot. We're not going to go over all of these one by one, but I will pick out some that are most commonly used. The light path node provides data for which kind of light ray is seen in your Blender scene. Each ray just starts out as a light ray. And then when it refracts, reflects, transmits, or anything else, it will change states. And those are the states that you can get from this light path node. The top two are the most commonly used the camera ray and the shadow ray the camera ray is mostly used to mask something that you don't want to be seen in the camera but you do want to have impact on the lighting or the other way around and then the shadow ray is used for masking out objects that you don't want to have a shadow and then at the bottom of the node you also have the depth for all of these light paths and this is just a number stating how many times a ray has gone through that phase so if a ray has transmitted five times then that value will be equal to five if you learned something please leave a like and subscribe if you didn't please leave a comment and I'll try to help you.